Afternoon guys. Um, these short clips that I'm going to bring you today um, are for wheelchair um, being stored in the boot. Sadly, uh, the particular gentleman I picked up with this rigid frame uh, wheelchair, which you can see goes in the boot easily. It was too busy in the shopping mall where I was. Um, I didn't have time. Obviously, I'd have to hold the people up and I obviously wanted to get back home. Um, I'd have to set the tripod up and I will get around to a full uh, entry and exit from the vehicle. I'm still waiting for my lady um, uh, to come back into town. She's out at the moment, out of town. So once she comes back in, I'll do the full in and out as a passenger uh, for the domestic market um, as well as our industry, so you can see how good it is. Um, as far as disabled access is concerned, I say that gentleman um, had no problems at all. Um, the seat was in the normal position, just didn't have to push it back. There's ample room in the front. Um, and he actually said that it was actually nice because it was actually quite high like my old vehicle was which is what I commented on before regarding the driving position but also for passengers that can't actually move their legs too too well it's nice the fact they can literally just um, basically effectively if, with their body back into the seat put their bum down and as their head comes down because this has got exceptional headroom the 28 in Nissan Leaf and then they can just uh, swing the legs in or you can lift their legs in for them so that's all fine uh, the other clips are a child's uh, baby seat, which went in fine. Um, the dad wanted to pull his seat forward a little bit. So if you see that there's a distance between the actual baby seat and his seat, he didn't need to. I mean, there was ample room in there, but as you say, Annie was in the front. So it would give you a good indication of how much room there is for a child's seat in the back of the uh, 28 in Nissan Leaf. And the other clips are, the, there is uh, three walkers. There is uh, the red one is slightly bigger than the black one. Um, that goes in and the red um, fixed frame with the it's quite hard to describe they're the one that have got the four wheels uh, the other uh, two small ones are the ones that's got the front wheel at the front and two at the back and it pivots pivots in the middle you'll know about this guys if you're looking at this for relatives or in the taxi industry you've probably picked them up thousands of times but the other one with the handles outstretched with the four wheels either side that goes in the boot as you can clearly see but you have to lift it um, and put it in pretty much dead straight as it goes in so instead of just putting it in like straight into the boot i mean you're going to be looking that way you have to put them like uh not diagonally but they have to be in a little bit just to clear the um like the slight uh they're not wheel arches they're um like where the uh plastic moldings come out anyway guys um i so say i will get around to the other wheelchair uh, access in and out in due course um and i haven't forgot my e-pedal um uh, video I've done uh, clips regarding going up and down ramps. They're all done. I've done, we've got quite a steep hill near where I live. I've covered all of that as well. I'm just waiting for the right time to actually do um, some s slow speed ramp uh, filming, which I'm going to have to do early in the morning um, in one of the car parks to show you how, how good this uh, vehicle is in going over those ramps with the e pedal. Um, and I've got to wait for some traffic. Sadly, the kids are off school in the UK um, for this last week and this week, and the traffic's very light, uh, the hours I work, so I haven't been able to do any footage on that. Um, but say so that's all to, due to come. I'm also gonna do a mini review on the uh, tires that are actually fitting the standard to these vehicles. I mean, I appreciate as the uh, vehicles get released further into the coming years, they might change brands like a lot of manufacturers do on, on tires. Uh, but this particular vehicle comes with the Dunlop um, NSAVE EC300, I believe. Um, so I'll be doing uh, wet use with the front facing camera with me in the vehicle and uh dry as well that's all due to come as well anyway guys i will speak to you guys soon and that's about it for now bye guys so i give it a good indication then obviously you're uh, controlling anything it's fine so standard small walker there you go. goes in easy okay so there you go, so basically goes in, pull it up in the middle and actually put it in uh, sideways if that makes any sense.